What's up? It's your girl Alexis Banks. So I want to drop a small quick bomb on you guys. We are on the road. We are going down the road and we are hauling down the road. So I have this new horse, um, Shika Jet Fuel, aka Denim Dan. Um, I just call him Dan. And so we have had ups and downs. He um, hauls great, practices great, does amazing, haul him to uh, a show of, you know, 10, 20, 30 minutes, 45 minutes down the road, does amazing, get him in a trailer, haul him a few hours, and <laughs> he just falls apart. So I had this idea, crazy idea. Usually you season colts, you take them down the road, take them to small bra pra bleh, 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 practices, um, keep it close to home, keep it cheap. And I told my husband, what if we do the opposite? <laughs> What if we haul him, like we're hauling him to rodeos and we take him down the road and we season him and we find the right barrel races and we go as far as we can and we haul him uh, just like a normal rodeo season and see if we can get him figured out because he does love his job and he's having so much fun and he's so athletic and he's so amazing. Um, I just can't, it's hard to fix something or practice something when it only happens when he decides for it to happen. So, yeah, first stop, we're in Arizona, Texas to Arizona. We ran at Marana yesterday, and he did good. It was a lot going on. Uh, he's not used to the laxadaisiness as uh, the races are run like the one yesterday. Uh, but we had a great time. He ran good, and we had some progression. So tomorrow we're going to Eloy, uh, which is just a few hours down the road and then we are gonna haul somewhere in Texas, I don't know yet. Weatherford or Decatur, if I'm saying that right? One of the two. So stay tuned. This video is boring and not so fun, just giving you the 411, but it's gonna be good. So please follow our journey, uh, hashtag Season Dan. Let's get it done, you guys. Thank you, if you're not subscribed, subscribe. Click the notification bell and please come back to see me. Bye y'all. What is going on guys? So we are making our first stop. We are out of Wilcox and headed to Eloy. Uh, we are gonna get some roping in tonight for this guy and run some barrels. Don't mind the squeaky ramp. Anyway, I just wanted to give you guys kind of a stop. So we just got this living quarters. Um, we're so excited to have it, so very blessed. and. We're making our first thumb stop on our haul. Are you ready? Mr. Stinky's going down. Mr. Stinky. All right, guys, I'll let you know how it goes. Okay. Thumping Mr. Stinky went terrible. Not good. So, on to the next place to dump. Arizona. Uh, James is already saddled up and on his horse and I'm gonna hang out watch the roping and barrels is to come after. So I went ahead and uh, put my run in from Marana. It was a, you know a new pin for Dan, a new outdoor pin. It was a lot going on, a lot of music, uh, a lot of people riding around. So he wanted to be a little bit of a turd, didn't want to pick up his correct lead to the first, gave him a little opportunity and finally uh, when I still didn't feel it when I wanted it, I asked him for it and he gave it to me. Uh, his mind <laughs> was everywhere but where it needed to be, but that's okay. That's why we're hauling and seasoning him across the West. So yeah, anyway, this arena is super, super cool. Let me show you guys if I can get it flipped around. Nope, can't do it. So anyway, uh, arena is super cool and yeah, stay tuned for the update. Here are the two barrel ponies hauling. Dan's crazy. My impatient two year old. <laughs> All right, y'all.
guys, so there was some team roping for you and we are walking to the arena. Stay tuned. What is going on y'all? So I posted my video for my run today. My thought process behind our run today was to stay really cool, calm, collected. Um, I really felt like our run in Marana was not a step forward that I was looking for. Um, I felt like his immaturity really came out, but hey, listen, that's why we are doing this. We are going down the road, we are traveling, we are hauling, calling and we are exhibitioning a horse um, a little against the grain I would say but I really think we're gonna get somewhere with it and I think it's been such a fun learning process um, but anyway our run I wanted to stay slow and correct and I just really wanted him listening to me giving to me uh, I felt some soreness today we weren't like super crazy about so we do have our team taking a look at some video of him and uh, we'll address that. But for the most part, I couldn't have been more pleased for how he worked. Uh, we were in a roping arena today, so there was a lot to look at, a lot of banners, a lot of cattle around. And that's why we're doing what we're doing. And I just feel so blessed, such on a high, such on cloud nine that I am able to do this. I'm able to haul down the road and we're getting to season Dan and uh, I just can't express how much myself, my husband, our team, um, everybody just believes in this horse and we think he's going to be something great and we hope that we get to be something great so that's kind of what we're working towards. Um, we finished up James Got to Rope today which I sent some clips. I hope you guys liked that uh, and then I got to run barrels. We are staying tonight here in Picacho or uh, Eloy and then we're hauling back home to Texas tomorrow. We'll be down for like a day and I think we're gone again on Thanksgiving and hauling. So we're taking this super serious. We have some really, 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 really big goals. Um, God willingly, we will finish uh, by the end of this year already. I know I'm running out of time and yeah, we're seasoning Dan and we can't wait and we're so excited. So thank you so much for following us on this journey on our first little uh, haul. And please, if you're not following me on my other social media outlets, do that. Um, you can find all of my information down below on Instagram at Lexi Lou. And please do not forget to hashtag Season Dan so I can follow y'all following our story. And we can all stay connected on this glorious internet. So anyways, you guys, I'm so, so, so exhausted and ready to pack everything up. Yeah, I just, I don't even know. I'm so excited and I'm so happy and I'm so blessed. And until next time, bon voyage, y'all. Thank you.